Today, I did want to talk about reservations. When we did the Camino um, two years ago from Sevilla to Santiago along the Camino Frances, we had booked, my wife had said, we're going to do this Camino on the condition that I have a private bathroom and I have my own private room. Or private room in the sense that me and the family would share the room with her, but no, no one we didn't know. So I made that happen. We made the reservations. And there's only one city where I had some difficulty trying to find a spot that could accommodate the private room and private bathroom situation where we actually had to go ahead and get a room where that could have been shared. But fortunately, nobody spoke that night in that same room with us. So it was a private room. We did have a shared bathroom with just one other room, um, but we had a key. So it wasn't, it was kind of private, semi-private. So I dodged a bullet on that one and we made it. So this time I did hear from a number of YouTubers. There are fewer, there's fewer lodging, fewer food places along the Camino Portuguese. And so when I was making these reservations, I did notice, again, this is for private bathrooms and private rooms. There were not as many options um, as there were in Spain. And there is a couple of those uh, routes that are about 33 kilometers long. And if you want to stay in either one of those sides, that's fine. But if you want to have some place in the middle, to kind of break up that walk. On one of those, there's like only literally two places with the private room and a couple of the regular hostels and albergues. So not many options at all. And uh, you might be walking a little bit further than you expected if you don't make those reservations. Just a warning. A lot of people like to have the freedom just to um, play it by ear. When I was in my 20s, during the, the Euro Rail back in the day, yeah, I just, I just, I just winged it. But now, no. I like to have, I like to know where I'm going at the end of the night. Yes, sometimes it pushes me to go further than I really want to because I'm maybe a little bit tired. Or maybe I'm like, dang, I got so much energy, I just want to keep going. Um, so having, making those reservations does limit your flexibility on that. But, for me, I do enjoy knowing I've got a place at the end of the night. I'm not going to be searching for anything at the end of the day. So that's what I wanted to say about the hotels and the lodging. One Camino.